Hey everybody, it's Ped's Card Collection coming back at you with another video. And today we got a pretty exciting one for you. I uh, made potentially one of the biggest trades of all time uh, with Troy, Troy Banks. So thanks again, Troy. Sent him a bunch of Phillies cards, Alec Bohm, uh, rookies, Chrome, Mojo rookies, a bunch of Phillies autos, uh, Hoskins, Howard, Nola, stuff like that. And uh, in return, he put together a pretty insane package. So thank you again, Troy. Really, really appreciate it. So um, I know there's one huge PC card in here and there's one massive card on top as well. So let me just grab a card to cover it up real quick. Let's take the Jazz Chisholm short print. So we got a nice stack. You see a lot of thick cards, empty, and uh, it's usually a sign that there aren't too many base cards. So let's get to the first card here. I don't know how to do this. Um, do a little slow reveal. So the first card is a pretty sick card. Check that out from Triple Threads Baseball, Alex Bregman. Bat Relic Auto, Rookie Auto to 99. Triple Threads was one of the things that got me into collecting. Or I used to watch videos of the Triple Threads box being br broken on YouTube with my friend in high school, my best friend in high school. And uh, we always dreamed about opening a box. And uh, this is from one of those releases, 2017 Triple Threads. This card is insane. It is immaculate. It's got the sweet gold look to it. Piece of his bat. Nice clean autograph of Alex Bregman. Beautiful blue ink on that gold. Nice, uh, whatever that's called, but nice Alex Bregman rookie auto bat relic to 99. Put that on a stand for sure. So this is going to be a pretty wild one, guys. Like I said, probably the biggest trade of my life. Uh, about a year ago, uh, Troy also gave me a really good deal. He sold me a lot of his collection, a lot of his high-end stuff. So uh, we traded some stuff back and forth. I think one of the cards is actually coming back to me in this. And it's going to be a pretty big PC card, but we'll get to that later. And this is a pretty massive card, guys. Clayton Kershaw. Jersey to 199 from 2020 tops baseball check that out future hall of famer to 199 it's got the sharp black borders i pulled a bellinger out of this from one of the tins actually and um so this will pair up nicely with that the 35 anniversary emblem but yeah if you haven't watched that live stream it's a while ago i i think it's titled like i did a live stream just like uh high-end unboxing collection something like that but let's get to the next card here it's going to be a lance berkman this one is from tops 2008 he was a menace back in the day so it's a sweet card there Next up, we got a Burt Blylevin rookie card. Hall of Fame pitcher from 71 tops. Just a beautiful card. Absolutely love this. This uh, 71 design is so beautiful. And uh, to get one of the key rookie cards out of that set is freaking insane. Oh my God, dude. No way. Next up, Alex Bregman refractor chrome rookie card check that out guys a beauty troy is a or he was i know he's now more of a phillies fan but it's from texas so he also likes the astros and to give one of this up just goes to show uh just you know what kind of person he is so just a really nice card 2017 tops chrome alex bregman rookie refractor and this next card they were just showing on the mets broadcast on sny sports new york they were talking about ted klazuski they had to cut off 
the sleeves and make the jerseys vest because his muscles were too big. And this is that same exact card. Ted Klazuski from 57 Tops. How sick is that card? Number 165 of the set. This is a beautiful set. 57. Card is in excellent condition. Centered really well. And check out the guns on that bad boy. I mean, he's a tank. He's got the veins popping, the striations snapping, the cap flapping, the bat rapping. Cincinnati Red Legs, first base, beast, behemoth of a being, Ted Klazuski, 57 tops. How are you? And I'm also running on a little adrenaline rush from James McCannon, hitting a pinch hit, two run, go ahead home run in the eighth inning. And I'm currently missing part of the bottom of the eighth to record this video, but this was a special video that I wanted to get out and share for all you guys and upload it on Tuesday. Keep the keep the uh the mojo rolling. Been hot lately, so I thought this would be a great time to get into these cards and share this with you guys. So hopefully the Mets can hold on, but here we go. Got a Carlos Correa Bowman card. Looks like we have another Alex Bregman triple threads. Tri-colored relic number 10 out of 18. Check that out, guys. Just another beautiful card. Thick card stock. Only 18 of these made. Just insanity. Got a Ken Griffey Jr. relic card. Insane. One of the greatest players, most iconic, one of the most iconic players of all time, the kid, Ken Griffey Jr. relic card from Topps 2020 Baseball. So we're starting, it. this is going to be an insane, it already is insane, and uh, definitely let me know what you guys think in the comments below. Once again, I really appreciate the deal. Gave up a lot of my best Phillies cards, but I mean, he's always hooking it up and I, I really appreciate the support. So got a 1500 subscriber giveaway coming up, by the way, guys, got a nice Steve Carlton Turkey red hall of famer. I'm going to be going live this Friday, this Friday around eight, eight thirty Eastern time. How about a Mike Scott? Buyback auto, 89 tops on card, blue ink auto. He was a beast on the mound. He used to destroy the Mets. It's got the authentication sticker there. Uh, Mike Scott, he was an unbelievable pitcher. Not sure if he might have been a Hall of Fame, borderline Hall of Famer, but he had, I think he had a nasty either sinker or like splitter or something that just gave people nightmares so check that out from tops all-time fan favorite certified autograph issue of mike scott blue ink and this is by far the biggest trade i've ever made in my life and the hits are in they're not stopping so here we go let's keep going i know there's a there's a couple bigger ones one in particular that's going to blow you guys away it's probably uh, definitely a big PC card. Another Bregman rookie card there. So nice. Got a McCullers Refractor. And this is a card I actually traded to Troy. And then, uh, you know, we traded some stuff back and forth. So I actually did pull this one myself. It's a Josh James Topps Chrome Sapphire Rookie Auto from 2019 Topps Chrome Sapphire. Just a sick card. I got these when uh, they were back under $200, and now they're, uh, I think they're approaching like $1,200, so I think I got in at the right, or I got the box at the right time. I even hit a one of one. Unfortunately, it turned out to be a pretty, uh, you know, pretty bad person, <laughs> but uh, we're just going to move on. But uh, anyway, future Hall of Famer, Yadier Molina Bat Relic. Why not? Just a sweet looking card. Piece of his bat. One of the greatest catchers of all time. 
I'm running out of stands, so I'm gonna have to start putting stuff flat, but next up is a really cool card. Michael Lorenzen, Blue Ink Autograph, Team USA Baseball. I think he's now a relief pitcher for the Cincinnati Reds, who the Mets are playing right now. And he's got some of the most ripped forearms, jacked biceps of any pitcher in the league. I believe he might have served in the Navy or... Um, so that's pretty cool because uh, I know Troy served. So, you know, that's pretty awesome. Um, so uh, really nice. Michael Lorenzen, collegiate national team. I was actually watching the team uh, Stars and Stripes game was streaming on the Team USA YouTube uh, channel last night. They had, uh, you know, the, the minor leaguers versus, I guess, the some college guys, and you got all types of prospects, so it's really fun to watch, see them kind of get after it as they pr uh, prepare for the Olympics, I guess. So next up, really nice, Greg Jeffries, buyback on-card auto for the Mets. Nice PC card there. I'm going to start dropping them on, this, on the card mat. How about a Jeff Bagwell Hall of Fame relic bat piece? I love the Ginter, how they do that. The minis, they, you know, they put that nice, sharp looking frame around it. Gives it that Ginter look. And uh, by the way, guys, I was going through my Gypsy Queen box and uh, somebody had co mentioned the comments. Thanks for mentioning it. This is actually a Shohei Otani image variation. So really nice pull there. Not sure what I want to do with this, but it is a short print, so I just wanted to give you guys a heads up because I know it's hard, it's hard to catch them all when you're going through them at the time. But let's keep on rolling. Got a Nolan Ryan. And how about a Larry Walker Rediscover Tops rookie card? Hall of Fame rookie card. Love that. Just a sweet looking card. This is insane, guys. And, uh, Oh my God. Oh my, we got some, we got, after, we got some massive ones coming up, guys. I'm not going to lie. All right. Um, got a Mark McGuire buyback, rediscovered tops rookie card for the Oakland Athletics. How about a Cody Bellinger 2017 rookie debut rookie? Here we go, guys. This was one that got traded a little bit back and forth, and this is one of my f so excited for this one, guys. It's a Pete Alonzo Topps Brooklyn Collection Rookie Auto to 75 on card blue ink autograph. Check that out. Coming off a nice home run derby back-to-back -back win defending champion and uh he hit a home run in tonight's game big homer single i think he hit his 18th tonight so hopefully he can uh start getting that power bug it seems like there were some games where i had some high scoring runs today so i don't know what's going on there but uh hopefully it keeps on going for pete alonzo definitely my favorite card in the trade uh gonna have to put that next to the old bregman triple threads rookie auto and uh, the stage is already unbelievable. I mean, I don't have to say any words for, I mean, just look at it, just a little bit of everything and just high end, really nice cards. Two more to go, guys. How about a Brady Singer from Topps Tribute Baseball, rookie autograph out of 25. That is a gorgeous card. Unbelievable. Brady Singer from the University of Florida, Ultimate Gamer, one of the top rookie pitchers from this class out of 25, guys. I mean, that's insane. Brady Singer. And last but most definitely not least, Hall of Fame quad relic of Craig Biggio to 475 from Topps Museum Collection. 2015 baseball tops museum collection just came out for 2021 so you could kind of see the design and where it's been and where it's come from so just another pristine 
beautiful looking card that encapsulates uh, you know, a historic moment, an historic player of baseball that will live in history forever. So, I mean, guys, I'm absolutely speechless. Like I said, wanted to get this video out. Uh, biggest trade by far of my life. I'll just let uh, focus on the background for a little bit. But uh, like I said, can't thank you enough, Troy, for the awesome trade. Uh, Want to do pull some nice Phillies pulls are definitely going your way for sure. I know you're on that Phillies train now. Just don't just don't catch us in the uh, NL East, and we'll we'll be good. We'll we'll keep making trades. So, <laughs> but uh, hook me up with the like, guys. Let me know in the comments below what you thought. What were uh, some of your favorite cards from this trade? And uh, just super super appreciative. So. Uh, my mind is blown. Um, still got to pick my job from the floor. Don't really know what else to say. Just been an incredible video, incredible cards. So, uh, yeah, that does it, guys. But I uh, hope you all have a great rest of your week. Thank you again for the amazing trade, Troy. Um, and, uh, yeah, like I said, going live this Friday. Should be posting a couple more videos this week, and then I'll be off on my way to the National next week. Super excited. Uh, you know, it's going to be it's gonna be live. It's going to be live. So I'll catch you all in the next one. Ped's Car Collection out. Take care.